Yes. Okay. Okay. Um, we can we can do the Bellman, I guess. Um, can can we do eleven thirty then? Thank you so much. Um, we have to leave. <laughs> what? They're asking us to get out of this room. We don't have to like take our own stuff, but we have to get out of this room. And they're sending a bellman, so we have to like pack up our stuff. We've only been here for less than 24 hours and they're already kicking us out of this room. So I know you look kind of crazy. I'm sorry that we're putting you on camera like this, but- Just woke up. I don't know if it's my card. I don't know if it's whatever. I don't want to leave. I guess we should start off the vlog. What is up, Travel Squad? We are back at it again. Back at it again. And today, we just got here, but we got to get out apparently. We've been here less than 24 hours. <laughs> Later. And we got all our bags packed and ready for them to be here. Laura's getting ready because she's like, if I'm going to get kicked out, I'm going to look nice while I do it. All right, goodbye room. He's taking our luggage all the way down. All right, let's go. Heading up to the front lobby to see what's up. I think we have to give this back. Probably. Uh. Um, Laurel, what just happened? Why are we still, we still have our key cards. Please explain. This just became the best vacation ever. Seriously. Is what just happened. Little backstory is that we're Hilton Honors guests. We have gold bands. I have status at Hilton. And yesterday I asked the lady, I was like, hey, do you have any upgrades? She said no. Well, this morning that phone call that we got was to upgrade. What do you, you don't have a ring. Why are you showing off your hand like that? <laughs> well, rub it in. Why don't you? We just went in there, like upgraded our room in the same building. And I cannot wait to show you. It is Laura's favorite. I got to stop zooming in because I'm so excited right now. Oh my God. First, I didn't want to leave the resort now i don't even want to leave our room for real before we head back to the room and show the room you want to check down here or maybe even out there to yeah. see if we can get some swim trunks for me so you stop soaking your boxers yeah for real that sounds bad <laughs> <laughs> well there's a store right here do you want to go look in there yeah i already see some dresses and i know we're not going in there for that but they look pretty well they did find some i can yeah i don't mind these oh no did you find something <laughs> that is really nice though yeah look how pretty there's these pretty little tassels in the back. I can see you wearing that. And then also that dress over there too is nice. It's actually a jumpsuit. That's a, Yeah, this is a nice swimsuit. It looks like your back of your phone case. So pretty. Do they have your size in that? I don't know. That's 40% off. Oh, 40% oh. off. Oh boy. What do you think about that? It's pretty, but I didn't like the way it fits. So I'm putting it back. Laura, should we show them our new room? Yeah. All right, let's do another room tour. Well, hello there and welcome to our Villa 2.0. Come on in. We did a room tour yesterday, so we're just gonna do a quick room tour. Coffee, bar, dressers. We showed you guys that yesterday. It's in her sink, safe, robes, over here. Bathroom, toilet, shower, right over there. Everything's the same. The one thing that's changed is we come in here and we have two double beds. We no longer have one big king for me and Laura to share. We each get our own full-size bed, which is nice because we I don't have to bother you. You can sleep all day. There's Finally. They are the same softness, same beds. Amazing. TV, couch, the hot tub that we used yesterday, still same size. Pretty much everything in this room is same size. It's like, you're like, probably like faint. But why are you upgraded? Laura, do you want to show us the upgrade? I sure do. All right, take your clothes off. <laughs> we have a pool front suite now on the ground level. Ah! We were up there on the second floor in the same building. Now we have this. Little water baby over here is excited because you know she loves the water. Ugh. Look at that, just walk right out, take off your shirt and just hop right into the pool. Look at that. Here, come take the mic. So what do you think about the pool? It feels more like a warm pool, but I'm still very happy. You look like you should be there. You belong there. Don't call me a water baby again. Look at how happy she looks. Guys, look at this. This is amazing. Before I forget, if you haven't already, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Give us a trial period. Give us a little test, seven day free trial. If you like us, go ahead and subscribe. Leave a like down below. If you don't, 
kick us to the curb. No, no holes bar, hassle free. And if you don't like us, I want to know exactly why. So leave a little essay in the comments down Ooh, below with details. Yes, yes, five paragraphs, MLA format, seven sentences minimum, and cite your work. But if you're feeling a little more frisky, you can check out our memberships down below. We have both YouTube and Patreon for a few added extra perks. It feels weird saying a little bit more frisky, doesn't it? It does. That's your line. Come check us out. Soak in this pool. Just want to start off. Hi, my name is Fane. This is my first drink of the day. It's a double sprite in vodka. Hi, I'm Laura, and this is my first drink of the day. Hold on. The thing about these cups is that you can you get small cups like this when you like get a drink, but you can also bring your own cups and have them fill it up and get more drink in your cup. I think what's really cool about these resorts is that Royal Caribbean, you would have to like wait a few minutes or they would fill up a cup like this. Yeah. Or any cruise line, not just Royal. But like I asked, hey, can I get a double vodka pineapple and a shot of tequila? And they just brought it on over. Cheers. Are you ready? It's ice cold water. We're really thirsty. It's probably warm now because no, it's been in the it's sun. Just, it's ice cold water. That's what I have to tell myself. Although I do think that helper. The limes here are so like Tart. extra limey. Can they get behind me? Oh. <laughs> and this is how we make our photos. <laughs> we take too many of these. <laughs> so this is our pose that we take our photos in. So if you guys ever want to see it on Instagram, go check out our Instagram. And now we have a spa appointment. We were almost, we actually are late. We're pretty late actually. Yeah. We were just enjoying each other's company in the pool and having some drinks and I legit think I could stay there all day, like 12 hours. So here's the thing. This is what happened to us. This is the full story. So what ha happened was we booked this resort using Laura's travel agent discount. It was $600, $660, whatever it was. And then we got upgraded and a spa package included for another $500. It sounds like a lot, but that room, if we would have booked it straight out, would cost us over $2,000. And the spa was like three, $400 each. So the fact that we made out, when she charged us, it was like $1,000. Yeah, and with all, all food and all drinks included, shots, it doesn't matter what type of drink. So a swim up pool and a spa treatment for under, for $1,000 and six, $1,060, that's how much this whole four days cost us to stay here and everything. Not that at all. Cheaper than a cruise. Some cruises, let's say, it, say that. But full transparency, that's how much it has cost us to stay here and get that room too. I'm not guaranteeing that you'll get the same perks, but it is pretty nice. We were just out there, and now we're walking through this jungle maze area. Is that a waterfall? Oh my gosh, it is. It's like a little waterfall in the pool. Ooh. That will feel so good on your back. I feel like you can get in there. The in and wellness. Look at that. Oh, there's a sauna right there. Stop. All right, let's go check in. Moments later. So unfortunately, we could not go and get, or Laura couldn't go and get her spa done. Kind of like a mess up, a little miscommunication on our end. But we're able to get a schedule for 5 p.m. today, so Laura will be going back. And they just showed us the cold plunge and the thought like the sauna and the hot tub you know what i think our plan should be for the rest of today let's go get something to eat go get our swimsuits back on we can come here and use the i would do the cold plunge i wish yeah. we could do it together but yeah i know i wish we could too use those areas and then i'll get my massage hey let's go i love this place <laughs> Lori, you know what what I'm not even worried about getting in this pool i mean it has music and all that but because we have our own pool now we don't have to worry <laughs> about that i do still want to come out here just for like the vibe Oh my gosh, Fane. What? <laughs> I think I'm done with cruises. Really? <laughs> this is absolute paradise. I can't even describe it. It's just like a different atmosphere. And I think this is why I liked Virgin so much and I yeah. knew I would. Virgin feels more like an all-inclusive. If Virgin had all the drinks included, that would be a game changer. But this is just like the atmosphere. So I'm upset. 50,000 on my head, the disrespect. Exactly. So. Like, Travel Squad had gone in and was like, yo, you should do these all inclusives. They didn't tell us, we had to ask them. They didn't let us in on the no. They were just like, oh yeah, you guys should try these out. Where were you guys? You guys should have told us about this lifestyle. You guys didn't tell us that you didn't express how amazing it is. Yeah. Exactly. This is awesome. This is amazing. You thought you loved us. I know. You guys talk about how much you like Laura's eyes and how she's awesome, but yeah, you, you kept this secret from us? Rude. For shame. 
What do they do? For shame. <laughs> <laughs> but no, for real though, this has been an amazing experience. Guys, 10 out of 10. I'm very happy. Very happy. Thank you for this. We literally would have never known this process if it wasn't for you guys. So, thank you. Cheers, my love. Cheers, my love. Yeah, it's, I, without the salt, it's really good. This is great. Thank you, guys. So far for me, the main difference is that with all inclusives, you don't get to like travel to different locations. Right now, I'm kind of okay with it because we needed this. I think this needs to be an annual thing, Laura. Shout out to my boy Kyle Palo with the shrimp cocktail, baby. We got a lot of shrimp in there. What did you get? For my appetizer, I got the uh, tortilla soup. Look at us tofu in it. You know what I appreciate? about this place for the food wise is that they give us like portion sizes you can no. get as much as you want like it's not big portions like last night our dinner was like four sushis this is like a, not a deep bowl it's like a nice sized bowl i'm gonna be like good satisfied but not overly stuffed it's like a healthy portion and i got the crispy quesadilla i was like i'll splurge a little bit and get that i mean it's a good size. I think it's kind of like a crunch wrap. Like, oh, I should have got that. Yeah. Yeah, it's not like a crazy size. So like, this is great. I don't know what Laura has. She has a touch. Yeah. But there's multiple I'm cats. Yeah, Over here. Laura has the gifts. Oh, it's a book to your baby. And now a quick word from our sponsors. <laughs> this will be quick, I promise. Over the last year, we love seeing your videos and your pictures. And some of you have even told us that you say it all the time on vacation. I mean, it is kind of catchy. So to confirm that we heard you, we are too excited to confirm we are dropping a new merch line today. Inspired by the Travel Squad. Hi, my name is Laura. And this is my first drink of the day. <laughs> How cute is that? Show mine, show mine. Hi, and I'm Fane, and this is my first drink of the day. And on the back, we have the logo. So you guys can see from Laura's shirt, we have a name tag that says, hi, my name is. And then on the back, there is a drink glass with first drink of the day, and the outline says Travel Squad. And this design has the quote on the front, and of course, Travel Squad on the back. And I know you guys are gonna ask, yes, we have corresponding hoodies and sweatshirts to show everyone you're a part of the exclusive first drink of the day club, even in the cold months. So like November, January, February, whatever you want, you have something to wear. And you can take them on your cruise with you and sit out and look at the stars on the deck at night. And both these designs come in multiple colors and sizes. Wait, I think you forgot something. Okay, what? What did I forget? We got cups too. Yeah, we have a pint glass. We have an insulated Stanley dupe cup. We also have an insulated wine glass and a coffee mug. We haven't gotten those yet, but they're on our site. Every purchase you make helps support our channel to keep it running for a long time to come. Oh, and by the way, as a thank you to you guys, the first five people to place orders on our website using code FIRST First five will get 20% off their entire order. So if you've been wanting an L's and t-shirt or back at it again hoodie, you can get those at a discount, baby. And thanks again for all the love you guys have shown us on our videos over the last few years. Now back to the video. So we're back. Laura's probably gonna get her massage, but I'm gonna do the ice bath because we did. We looked at it earlier and it looked really nice. I wish I can show you guys or give you guys a smell in here. It smells so good. like. Sounds like Fruity Pebbles, kind of. Well, I guess this is a do, bit of do. You're gonna go into your little area, I'm gonna go into mine. I wish we could do this together. Yeah, but. We do everything together, so. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go check out my plunge ice bath and see what that's like. That's the first thing I'm getting into right now. So here we have the ice bath. It is super cold and I cannot wait to get in. Time for my massage. There's two beds in here, but Fane didn't wanna get one with me, so. It's just me, myself, and I. So you see this clip right here? Yep, it's me just chilling, max, and relaxing, all cool in the ice bath. That thing was cold. But two seconds before this clip happened, this happened. Yeah, that's a traumatic event. So as I get into this hot tub, right from the ice bath, which is kind of a shock, that's why these clips don't have any audio. So in here, I'm seeing how hot it is. It's really hot compared to the ice cold bath. Right here, I'm spitting some fat beat rhymes. You know, the whole Mon Spaghetti level type of bars. And these weak arms are heavy. There's vomit on a sweater already. Mon Spaghetti. Probably even financial advice right here. We don't ever know because your boy messed up the mics. <laughs> and I have no clue. But yeah, just want to let you guys know, 
everything's not sunshine and rainbows behind the scenes. In the comments down below, let me know if you guys are, if any one of you guys are spa people, because I'm still getting used to it. Lord's a spa person, but maybe I'm the outlier and just getting used to it. I don't know. It's really nice and calm and peaceful here. Let us know in the comments below. You can tell this one is the steam because you can see the steam rising off the water. This one, not so much, it's the warm pool. So I think your boy will be staying in here and enjoying my time. How do you feel? One of the best massages I've ever had. Wow, you looked like you just fell asleep or woke up. I was falling asleep at the very end. And she brought me tea. Oh. <laughs> Well, I'm glad you had a good time. Thank you so much. Oh my god. I might be in for the night. <laughs> <laughs> How was that? Is that everything you wanted, wish you could have and wanted? I started to pass out at the end of it. I don't even remember what I told you when I first came out. Like, I was in such a daze. I forgot I still had clothes to go put back onto the <laughs> locker room. She's like, I'll escort you to the locker room. I was like, okay, but why? <laughs> like, I didn't, I don't know. I'm still kind of out of it, but I feel so insanely at peace right now and do we have to go to dinner i mean i kind of want it's caribbean night probably gonna get directly to the pool right now too really yeah i mean i guess the order food and then they can bring it to our pool this is literally a pointless vlog we just swam and ate all day like we're kids at a, the neighborhood pool we're living our best lives right now wait laura are you really gonna get in the pool right now yeah i think i was kidding yeah no. you're not even gonna go around She is a true water baby. And there she is. She looks short in the pool because of the, the, the water refraction and the lights. Do you want me to order room service or something? One hour later. Finally was able to get Laura out of the pool. <laughs> and this is her outfit of the day for dinner. Nothing special, but I literally just didn't want to put anything else on. Yeah, she's trying to get back in the pool. <laughs> you probably are going to get in the pool tonight. I don't think I will again tonight because I've already taken two showers today and I'm kind of over it. So we're kind of trying to figure out where to go right now. Looking at this Mexican restaurant on site, but we also ate Mexican for breakfast and lunch. So. And we're going to have it tomorrow on our tour. Yeah, on the tour. <laughs> Unfortunately, the restaurant we had, we thought we had books was closed today and then the other one we went by was kind of full so we're just gonna go back go to the room order some room service chill out in both our separate beds <laughs> and then get ready for tomorrow because honestly going on. that we sounds a, incredible we have we have a little bit of an excursion going on tomorrow leaving we're leaving this paradise to venture out into the city can you still call it an excursion if you're not on a cruise ship five minutes later so here's the thing Here's the thing, we're so idiots. So here's the thing, yes. We got our reservations wrong in the wrong days, so we went to the wrong restaurant, and that's why it was closed. We have that tomorrow. Uh, but this one's called Kalamata, and it's the Mediterranean fusion restaurant. And they have a little buffet for the appetizers, so you can go up and get like salad, soup, meat, cheese, it's stuff like, like that. It's like Ruby Tuesdays. <laughs> yeah. They have a whole spread up here. I mean, it's obviously a buffet. But florist section over there, they got all the breads in the world. This is amazing. You can fill up just on this, I think. I got the lamb euro. The table got the gnocchi. And what did you get over there? Uh, the chicken parmesan with pesto alfredo, or pesto fettuccine. That looks really good. It does. Well, that is it for day number two at our first all-inclusive resort. It was pretty fun. It was a great day. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Yeah, we really just relaxed and all that. We didn't even do much. Honestly, we went to the pool, spa, new room. Cool. Tomorrow we have a little bit more exciting. We're doing like a food tour of like authentic, authentic Mexican food. So I'm actually excited for that because I love me some like tacos and stuff, like street tacos. But if you guys enjoyed this video, what can they do, Laura? You guys can check out this video right here where we went and took full advantage of Royal Caribbean's all-inclusive beach club. It was all-you-can-eat lobster and, and steak, and it was so good. Best steak of my life. I'll help you with that. I'll <laughs> hold you up. Bye, guys. Bye.